I'm born and raised in Calgary. I grew up playing for the Bow Valley organization and then the Buffaloes organization. Played for Kamloops in the WHL and then was lucky enough to play some uh, some games in the NHL. I headed over to Europe and I played uh, 14 years over there. My wife Erin and I, we had kids and the kids uh, grew up playing over there. The places I played had uh, outdoor ice so the kids could go on the ice uh, kind of whenever whenever they wanted so they were they were excited to do that. Yeah, it was special to live there for sure. Like a bunch of those big cities have, have so much history and you know just to learn some of that and just have that with me is just super special and just watching that just inspired me and my brother just to be like him. Landon didn't have the typical Canadian childhood, like walking into a dressing room where you nobody spoke English. None of the kids spoke English, all the kids spoke German. So they had to totally learn a new language, new way of life, new culture. Um, but I think it served them so well as they grow into adults because they're used to kind of being in new situations where they're a little bit uncomfortable. When Landon was 10 years old, I think, uh, we moved back to Calgary permanently, so then he, uh, he started playing hockey in, in Canada permanently. It's been special. Like, Calgary is such a beautiful place. All my grandparents are from there, my parents. It's just been, it's been awesome. Like, we're all super close. My family's super close, and so it's, it's been pretty cool. I think, honestly, from the time Lannan put on skate, he had something that was different from a lot of the other kids, and it was evident from an early age. Whether or not, we didn't know that was going to turn into anything, but you could tell that there was just a drive there. I've kind of always considered myself one year above my age group because I've always played with people older than me, and this time around last year is when I really took a step in my game, and, and I really thought that maybe I could have a shot at this. Landon, from the time he was a newborn baby until I think we were 10 years old, he spent Christmas in Davos, Switzerland at the Spangler Cup. You know, Santa came to the hotel and then we went to the outdoor rink. And then in the evening we would go cheer on Team Canada at the games and uh, it was just really special. Every event is different. This is going to be a lot different than the Spangler Cup, but um, again, kind of maybe gave him a little taste of what to expect. I was with another parent last night and we were both a little kind of teary-eyed seeing our boys on the ice wearing that jersey. Everything they have is going into playing for this team. So they're so honoured and so happy to be given this opportunity. It was always just a dream of mine and, and for that to be true right now is just surreal to me and it's been such an honour so far. It's fun to watch our kids play wherever they're playing. Team Canada especially though, I mean that's that's pretty it's what every Canadian dreams of, I think, and uh, yeah, I just hope he has a, a really good tournament and, and takes it all in and um, yeah, plays well.